Hi everybody, uh, welcome back to the VIA pinstriping page. I uh, just wanted to go over the topic of um, kind of the skinning over in the bottles, or the lack of, is the way I like to see it. Um, some people were asking how long does it last in the bottles as far as the one shot is concerned. Um, is skinning over a problem? And uh, I just kind of wanted to show y'all some of my um, first bottles. I, I've had this bottle probably over two years now. I have refilled it uh, since it got low. Uh, but there you have it, folks. That's the amount of skinning that you will uh, run into. You do want to periodically clean that off so that you make sure you get a nice seal when you shut the cap. Now being that this is an older uh, lid, it doesn't snap like some of the newer ones. So for example, let's say this one. Hear that snap. So this one creating a better seal because it's just way newer. It's actually a different design. This, this I get from SKS bottles. Um, it's got a smaller hole and a little kind of a nipple that goes in there. And uh, these I got from the Kafka website a long time ago. Well, I guess two year, about two years ago. And it has a larger uh, opening and uh, a kind of a different design. Uh, he says they're self-clearing, um, which they kind of are. But at the same time, if you don't clean them regularly or if, if you over-clean them and you kind of scrape off some of that edge... Uh, you might have an issue with it sealing, but I mean, for a two-dollar bottle, for it to last uh, two years or whatever, it's pretty good. Um, here's another bottle that I've had a long time. Again, that's it. That's the skinning over. Uh, sometimes, if it's in and out of the heat, you kind of will run into a little bit of a pressure issue where it's kind of wanting to bubble out on you. It's just something that uh, you know you kind of want to pay attention to. But uh, these should be cleaner. I just uh, sometimes I'll get to uh, a little bit much of a hurry and I don't clean the lids like I should. Uh, let's see here. See, it's a brand new bottle. I don't even know where I got this one from. But you see, that's, that's how they start out. Nice and clean. If you can keep it that way, you're going to be in great shape. But see this dark blue here I've had this dark blue same exact dark blue for over two years now and it, I still use it it does get a little bit thick uh, inside of there just from time but I mean it holds great I, I'd imagine if this was in a can uh, that probably would have dried up by now because it's really hard to get a good seal with them cans even if you use the screw uh, it's just opening them up. Uh, it's a big opening. Now, I know some folks, they don't care. They'll let it skin over and they're fine. They're making money. What's it matter if it skins over? You know, and I can agree. If, if you're making loads of cash and a little bit of skinning over on, on this paint, uh, it's not a big deal. You know, if, if, you're, if you got it like that. But I know some folks uh, are, are losing money with these cans. And that's why I transfer over to the bottles. Uh, because, as I've said before, I am cheap. And I don't run through paint that fast. Uh, I'm not a professional pinstriper. So, you know, I, I, I love this craft. I just, um, you know, I might practice a lot. <laughs> but... It just really helps. It's really handy. You know, you open up with one hand, pour it out, close it. One hand, I mean, you don't have to unscrew anything. You're good to go. So just wanted to kind of give that explanation and show kind of the, uh, you know, how much it skins over, which is really nothing. This one must have got sloppy on me. But skinning over really isn't an issue. And it holds really well. Just as long as you get the correct uh, type of uh, bottle, which is the PET plastic here. PET. 
which I know some of us have made the mistake of getting the wrong type of bottle and wasting a can of paint which hopefully if you have made that mistake you only made it once so that's it um, if that helps let me know and uh, thanks for watching have a good day